Uh, I'm very in love with my wife. I love her more than life itself. Love may make the world go round, but is there more to amour than meets the eye? Anthropologist Helen Fisher says when it comes to falling head over heels, each gender has its own agenda. Fisher and colleagues reported to the Society for Neuroscience their analysis of MRI brain scans of love-struck volunteers. We ended up with ten women who were madly in love and seven men who were madly in love. So it began to occur to us, why don't we see if there are any gender differences? The scans revealed that gazing at a picture of a beloved triggers the reward centers in the brain. But in men, regions associated with visual stimuli and arousal also lit up while women responded with brain regions corresponding to attention and memory recall. And it seems to make a great deal of sense to me. For millions of years, men had to um, size up a woman by looking at her, by looking at her to discover if she was healthy and young and able to bear him healthy babies. And for millions of years, women needed to size up a man to see whether he was going to be a good parent, a good father and a good husband. And for that, she had to remember what he promised yesterday, uh, did he bring buffalo meat three weeks ago? So if you're smitten with someone, keep in mind that your brain is working behind the scenes to size up your sweetheart. I'm Brad Closer.